Hello, here we are going to look at probability tree diagrams. The question given here is as follows. In a quiz program, the probability of correct answering three quizzes are 0 0.8, 0 0.5 and 0 0.2 respectively. Contestants will have to answer in the order of difficulty. Draw a tree diagram to show the possible outcomes. First one, what is the probability that a contestant will answer all three questions correctly? Second question, what is the probability that a contestant will answer all three questions wrongly? Thirdly, what is the probability that a contestant answer at least a single question correctly? So first task is to draw a tree diagram. And then let's look at the remaining three questions. So to draw a tree diagram, we can start with two branches, correct and wrong. Correct probability is given as 0.8 for the first question and 0.2 is the wrong probability. And after answering first question, we, the person can attempt the second one. If he was correct at the first time, chance was 0.8 and the chances of getting the second question correct is 0.5 getting that wrong is 0.5 so then the, this is the second question and he can attempt the third question which has a very low probability of getting correct and a high probability of getting it wrong 0.8 so similarly we can fill up the diagram tree diagram after correct wrong correct wrong and this is part of the uh, tree diagram and we can fill up the second part here this is first attempt wrong and second attempt correct second question correct second question wrong probability is still same here and then again we can fill up this to 0.2.8 and 0.2.8 this is a tree diagram that is uh, should fill up first and then we look at the first question what is the probability that a contestant will answer all three questions correctly that is p all correct probability of all correct actually it comes from here first question correct 0.8 second question correct 0.5 and third question correct 0.2 are the probabilities 0.8 times 0.5 times 0.2 equal to 0 0.08 is the answer to question one and secondly, what is the probability that the contestants will answer all three questions wrongly? That is probability of all wrong. So we look at the tree diagram here. First question wrong, second question wrong, third question also wrong. These are W, W, W. So P all wrong is 0.2 times, 0.5 times, 0 0.8. 0 0.08. Then the last question, what is the probability that a contestant answer all, answer at least a single question correctly? At least a single question correctly. See this diagram. Here, this branch has at least a C. Therefore, this is part of the probability. But you can see only one branch, that is WWW, has no Cs, no correct answers. So basically, what is been asked is p all p probability of one or more correct so at least one should be correct that is only except this branch all the other branches has one c here we have c that is correct wrong wrong correct wrong correct correct so at least one c is there therefore the answer should be the the complement of one a p all wrong that is one minus p all wrong so p all wrong we found earlier 0 0.08 therefore at least one correct answer is one minus p all wrong that means one minus 0 0.08 which is equal to 0 0.92 those are the three answers to this question